you lose a very big bet. If you ain't using it. Oh, nice place you got here. Oh, yeah, it's easy to mock, isn't it, huh? Cheap and fucking easy. But uh, this, this here is my place, and my work paid for my place. All right, relax, I was just being sarcastic. Yeah, well, don't be, all right, because the world doesn't need any more sarcasm. It's the blight of the age. Yeah, I get the point. You, you know, I get the point. You're like every other asshole. You made a bit of money, and you became a turd. Yeah, news for you, I was always a turd. No! You weren't, man, you were something! But now, man, you know, you're like this place, you're a shell. Go fuck yourself. Are you some kind of pure morally justifiable asshole? What, because you're, you're, you're totally psychotic, somehow it's okay? I'm honest, all right? You're the hypocrite. Oh, yeah, you're a fucking hero, so far above it all. Oh, yeah, well, I'm not above ripping open your fucking chest to see what's replaced your heart. Rip it open! See what's there, baby, because I'm ready. Hello? Oh, ladies, ladies, what's up? Fuck off! Listen, I'm sorry, but we've got a problem. Government funding thing. We need you to, uh, investigate a research lab upstate. It's about terrorism, the big one, nerve gas, biological terror. My God, I don't pay tax. Uh, listen, you'll need some fairly standard gear. Boat? Tandem rotor heavy helicopter, truck, weapons. You'll have to source all of that. <laughs> Chopper alone will set you back a couple of mil. Oh, no worries there. Trevor, he just came into a lot of money. Is that sarcasm? Oh, you're fucking A right at sarcasm. You fuck. A few weeks ago, I was happily retired, sulking by my swimming pool. My psychotic best friend shows up out of nowhere to torture me over mistakes I made, honest mistakes I made over a decade ago. We, our little posse, are flat fucking broke. But hey, let's go out and spend two million dollars on a tandem rotor fucking chopper so I can go steal nerve gas from fucking terrorists. Forgive me, you ignorant fuck. But sarcasm is all I fucking got! Sarcasm! And a room full of you cunts! Yes! Woo! Welcome back, man! It is the old you! Yeah, 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 well, we gotta go. It's been great, but Dave here's got a Pilates class. Now remember, ladies, you keep us way out of this thing. Bye-bye! Ah, oh, Jesus. All right, I'll give Lester a fucking call. He said he knew about something. Now you tell him that we're driving towards Polito Bay. Come on, you're driving us up to the bank? Yeah, what is this? It's not an absence of taste, D. It's the opposite. 
opposite of taste. You should be a stylist. And then there's the tattoos, the hair, the weird music, the funny toys, the niche drugs, the everything. What the fuck are we talking about? You are a hipster. What? You're a hipster? I hate hipsters. Classic hipster tonight. I abhor hipsters. I eat them for fun. <laughs> hipsters will say they hate hipsters. Well, I really fucking do. Self-hatred, common hipster affliction. I don't think because I'm living out here away from the bean machines and the bankers. You're gentrifying. Soon, the skinny jeans will show up. The bus stops up here. All right, how long does it take us to get out here from LS? Come on, man, knock it off. What? I'm gonna break your fucking fingers, you don't knock that shit off. Well, please, all right, you alleviate the boredom. Ah, finally. Hey, 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 welcome to paradise. My car's this way. Cry out here. Don't worry, brother. Michael will take care of all your moisturizing needs. Oh. Shall we? Might as well get started. Ugh. Okay, let's take a look at this bank. And we'll go to the front of the bank, clock the entrance. If the paperwork's correct, the alarm will be a relic. He should be in and out before the local PD knows what's happening. <laughs> the entrance to the bank. Nothing special. It takes us around back. Okay. Would you look out? There's an empty lot behind. No one should pay attention to us back there. I like it. Yeah, the place is remote. It's got the right amount of foot traffic. This will do. Let's check out the alarm to be sure. Mm. It's not ideal. It's gonna cost more to break that system than the score is gonna pay. Well, we're gonna have to find a new score. No, no, no. Uh-uh. No. This is the score. What are our options? It's a dumb idea, but we could trigger the alarm. See what kind of response they throw out. That is a dumb idea. Hey, you heard the man, all right? Shoot the sucker. seconds and more on standby. You know, there isn't even 30 Victor of shots fired. Oh, this is a real headache. What do you got on the clock? 40 seconds. This is Toledo Security. Any updates on the Code 30 Adam? Backup ready to mobilize. This is not normal. The response is out of proportion. Cops in this county are dirty. The alarm just went off on their piggy bank. This is them. What is that, a 67 second response time? Four cars. More in the wings. Bad cops, garden dirty money. Fuck them. We can take this. Wait right here. We'll see if anything about their routine suggests a weakness.
<laughs> he says, what took you so long? Had to let you win. <coughs> Set up a board over here. Oh. Michael, man, your blood sugars are low. I'm making you some leftovers. I'm fine, T. Huh? No, I'm the host, man. You know, I don't want you to get hungry and moody, right? Then you're gonna be making the wrong decisions. I mean, I've been making wrong decisions my whole life. That's how I ended up here. Yo, bon appetito. Jesus Christ, Trevor, what is that? What's wrong with you? That's just a, a what? An eyelid. That's probably not even human. Unless the gas station job. Gentlemen, some plans for your attention? Oh, good. I'm gonna stay here a minute longer than I have to. So I think our little uh, experiments show that the response will be too quick to beat and too strong to walk through. That means you gotta face the cops head on. Dirty cops. Uh, the dirty cops head on. Head on. Man, I don't know. Well, you'll be prepared. Convoys carrying military-grade hardware pass near here to get to Fort Zancudo. I propose hijacking one and using the equipment to get an edge on the locals. I can get you the exact details of the shipment as soon as we're done here. Anyway, you won't be outside the bank too long. Toledo Bay is, well, it's a bay. So you're straight away from the water where Franklin can be waiting in a boat to get you out of there. I know none of this is ideal, but it's the only way I can see of taking the score and providing for your FIB paymasters. Fine. We need personnel? Just a gunman. They'll be taking on the cops with you, so my advice? Choose someone good. Ah, think about my buddy Chef, okay? Consummate professional. This really the guy you want? That should do. I'll get the equipment together. Michael, you reach out to Franklin. Trevor, mm -hmm. you do what you do. Roger that, and I'll call you when we're ready to move on this. Mm, you want a bunk with us? I mean, it's gonna be tight, but, you know, me casa, su casa. I, I'll get a motel. Thanks. Right, shop. Fine, I'll give you a ride. Adios, amigos! Franklin, buddy, what's up? Hey, look, there's these redneck dudes been looking for you, homie. Some angry motherfuckers. I found where they stay, man, and I've been following them. Okay, what's well, gotta be the O'Neill brothers? <laughs> what's left of them? I'll pick up Michael and we'll come to you. T, hey, man. Hey, Jimmy, it's your dad. Listen, if you get this, can you give me a ring? Tell your mom, too, will ya? And Tracy. Please, son. Your daddy's been a bad boy. <laughs> Please, son. <laughs> you want a sniff? The fuck is wrong with you? <gasps> <laughs> now, see, the way I see it, this country was built by and for gasoline. So I'm just trying to prove my patriotic duty by, you know, doing this stuff. <laughs> oh, man. It's cheap, but it's good. Gasolina? No. <laughs> wow. Sorry, Mrs. M. Jesus. Mikey, you want a beer? Oh, shit, I'm sorry, I don't have any low car. Oh, fuck you. Uh, where'd you two go when you went out, you and your boyfriend? Why do you care? I don't care. Just trying to conversate. Well, I was out putting some people in their place. Ah, you know, there's more of this gig than just going crazy all the time. Killing everyone in sight. Just because I like the life and you feel guilty about it doesn't make you more of a man than me. And you know what, deep down, I know you believe the bullshit. The picket fences, the fucking happy endings, and your street philosopher bullshit. That's gotten you real far. Oh, yeah, you've achieved perfect balance. Balance? <laughs> you gone. Man, ten years in the sun, your brain is melted. You, you say words that have no meaning. What is balance, huh? Huh? But I fucking kill only on the weekends. So Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, I'm doing yoga and meditation. Tuesdays and Thursdays, hookers and sticking up joints, huh? You call me mad? Uh, compared to you, I'm the sanest motherfucker I know. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh. sane, 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 sane. Okay. I am so fucking sane that I should open a fucking mental health clinic. <laughs> okay, yeah. Yeah, fuck, now you're gonna stop being an asshole? I don't know, but I'll try. Well, that, I'd like your honesty. Oh, yeah, I spoke to Franklin. Why? Unlike you, he hears that his homie's having trouble, right? And he has no problem coming to help. So you're ensuring that we lie low? Out here, by calling LS and inviting a known accomplice of ours you know to what? come out here, what, for a little visit? That is so fucking typical of you. So typical. You don't even ask about the trouble. You instantly think about yourself. You're right. I did do that. I apologize. It's not good enough. I'm leaving, huh? I might die. Hope you're happy. Hey, I'm coming with you. 
No. Yes, I am. No. If nothing else, then you get out of this fucking dump. You're not going. Have fun, boss. Oh, I'm going. Make sure you don't. Go stay off the lake. So what is Franklin doing for you anyway? He's tailing some guys, Mikey. Tailing.
wanna feel good, huh? Helping a friend in need? Come on, Chuck. Come on. Oh, yeah. Taking out some hillbilly crank dealers on a blood feud. That's what I live for. Hey, Trail, man, we're gonna borrow this and head back to town. Sure. Come on, Michael, man. I'll drop your ass off on the way back. Chuck, get in. Stay back to Castle Phillips, Mike. Yeah, thanks for the warning. You got a personal interest in Gold Coast, right? <laughs> Anyone think you'd done this before? Uh, according to Benelli's cell phone, he's at the construction site downtown. It's done. One small problem. My source squealed. Benelli's expecting a hit. Watch yourself and go equipped. You'll have a lot of muscle.
you out of business, motherfuckers! Taken care of, but man, that shit went south. I know. We better let this simmer now. Way too much heat. Very nice work, Franklin. Oh my god! 